What is going on guys? I am back here with another video today. We are back on the Goldwing. It is super, super late season. We're kind of in borrowed time right now, so I did not want to take the Supermoto. And today, we're with a few buddies and we're starting out at, uh, I believe it's called High Knob Point in uh, Loyal Stock State Forest. High Knob Overlook. Try to show you guys some views before we leave here. And today, as a destination, we're heading to D&D &D Brew Works. I guess it's about half an hour from here. So I figured it would be a good time to uh, do a little bit of filming and uh, take you guys along for the ride. This is a pretty cool place. We came here a little late to really see foliage and stuff like that, but it is really nice still. If you're ever in this area, it's near a town called Eagle Mare, I would highly recommend uh, checking this place out. It's really cool. Some of these views are just insane. Like I said, I wish we got here a little bit earlier in the season when the trees still had some leaves on them. But right now it's uh, the first week of November. So it is very much borrowed time to be on a bike. But we had a shocking almost 70 degree day today. So we figured, hey, why not take the bikes out for one last ride? Wow, that is incredible. That is a heck of a valley. I really love driving through dry leaves like this on the bike. I couldn't ask for a nicer day. To be out honestly it's almost 70 degrees which is incredibly peculiar for november Ooh, tried my best to miss that one that did not work Here. I didn't notice this when we uh, first got here. Gotta watch out for that. I think we're getting close to uh, the end of being in this state forest. Goldwing is the perfect way to see state forests. Alright, it looks like we're finally making it to the end here. So the place that we're going to eat now is called D&D Brew Works, I believe. I will uh, pop up an image with some info on it, like the address, maybe a little bit of history as well, because I don't know too much about it at the moment. One of the friends that we're riding with highly recommended it. He said that uh, uh, when his father goes on rides and stuff, he likes to stop there. So we figured we'd check it out. So one of the other places that we were thinking about stopping is called The Barn. And I guess it's a pretty well-known bar around this area. And it kind of looks like just like an old barn. We decided against that because we really wanted to try this D&D Brew Works out. I believe we have to go past the barn on the way back, so I'll try to point it out once we get there. So far, this has been a pretty interesting ride. It's pretty far compared to what we normally do, but so far it's been uh, cool. A lot of nice sights and stuff like that. I'm really interested to see how we'll make out time-wise, though. Ah, there's the barn. Established 1933. 
that does seem pretty cool i kind of wish we could have stopped there but i'm excited to see what DD &D brew works has to offer a lot of sticks in the road around here i have noticed that this will definitely be a place that uh i'll try to come back to when it's nice on a different bike going on here oh man I have no idea what is going on here something not good so far today we've gotten pretty lucky with the weather there's been a lot of roads that we have been going on where they'll start to get wet and then they'll dry up and then start to get wet again in one section and then be dry in another but so far we really haven't gotten caught in any rain just a few drizzles here and there i'm really hoping we don't get hit with some rain this afternoon that would suck driving home in the rain i guess it's better than driving there in the rain though Air Museum? That is crazy. That seems like it would be really cool to stop and see one time actually. I'm really hoping that the weather will uh, stay off enough so that I can take the, the Supermoto and maybe the Goldwing out one more time but I just don't think, I don't think it's in the cards anymore. It's already November. Comment down below if you guys are still riding or if you're getting close to the end of the season as well. Laporte du Shore. Yeah, like I said, I've never ridden over here before. I don't even think I've ever been here before. But pretty cool to explore new towns. I like exploring new towns and new places. All I know is I really hope we get to this uh, this brew workplace soon. I'm getting awfully hungry. That is pretty cool, honestly. I like that. I wonder how old it is. Man, I hope we don't get caught in it too bad. Or I hope it's just this drizzle. Like, we run into the same drizzle two or three times so far. But nothing that's really stuck around more than that. Nothing that actually gets us wet. So I'm hoping it continues to stay like that. We'll see, though. It looks like it's piling up pretty good on the windshield. Ah, uh, windshield wipers are not a good sign. Ah, oh, there we go. D&D Brew Works. Just like that, we're here. Oh, this place looks really cool. I like this place. I will definitely have to give a review on the beers and food even if it's just a uh, just a little something at the end a slide or something I don't know how much GoPro battery I have left at the minimum I'll post some clips from inside so you guys can see and uh, thank you so much for watching the video I appreciate it